So as we get back to the routine of heading to work and taking the kids back to school, the Utah Department of Public Safety here is reminding everyone to keep kids safe inside those cars. That's right, especially in the snowy conditions. Traffic specialist Katya Stepovic has more. Car crashes have been the leading cause of death among children for years now. And the Utah Department of Public Safety is asking for the community's help to change that. Utah law says that all children eight years and younger have to be in a car seat or booster seat while in the car. Carolee Burton with the Department of Public Safety has been working in the child passenger safety industry for over 30 years. She says while data has shown improvement in people wearing seatbelts and using child restraints, crashes are still resulting in childhood deaths. When I'm in the emergency room and a family's been in a crash and um, they have some kids who are hurt. They are all ears. And we want to get them before that happens, of course. Our aim is to make sure that all families arrive home safely. And um, I feel like it will always be an issue because we're talking about our children. We're talking about children who can't um, make these decisions for themselves. Burton says improper use of car seats and boosters is typically what sends a child to the hospital. So she suggests that these helpful tips. Make sure your car seat doesn't move more than one inch from side to side or front to back. And make sure you keep your child in a car seat until they exceed that maximum height or weight limit. If you're wondering if you have the right car seat for your child or if you installed it correctly, there are over 106 car seat inspection sites here in the state of Utah. We'll link where those are on our website, ksltv.com. For KSL 5 News, I'm Katya Stepovic.